Hey everyone, so today I'm doing my second New Year's Eve tutorial of this year. I'll link my previous one down below. This one is so effective and it's actually surprisingly easy. It's really, really simple and it doesn't take too long to do. So I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial and if you do want to see how to achieve this look, then just stay tuned. I'm beginning with two primers. I'm using a primer water spray by Urban Decay and then also just a neutralizing luminizing primer by Stila on top of that. And then I'm also using two products for my foundation today, the Cover FX Custom Cover Drops. I'm mixing in about two or three of those with this Aqua Foundation by Kojin Do. And I am just dotting that all over my face and blending it out with a flat top face brush by XO Beauty, which I love. Next up, I am going to do a little bit of cream contouring. I'm using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Cream Contour Kit and just drawing some little lines everywhere and then blending out those colors. I'm using a yellow color under my eyes as well. On my eyebrows today, I'm using the Illamasqua Brow Gel in Awe and I'm just filling in all of the sparse areas and kind of making my eyebrows a little bit thicker and more dramatic as well because this makeup look is quite dramatic. I want the brows to kind of even everything out. And you can see how much of a difference it makes. And then I'm going to prime my eyelids. This is the Benefit Stay Don't Stray. And then in the crease, super easy, I'm taking a warm brown and just blending that in really, really well. I'm putting it on with a blending brush and then using a clean blender brush to make sure all of the edges are nice and seamless and super, super blended. Next up, I'm taking a black eyeliner and putting that in my tight line and waterline. I'm making this look quite smoky because the focus is on the eyeliner. I'm going all out, so I'm also going to take a black eyeshadow and kind of blend everything out, I guess. Um, I'm kind of focusing on the outer lower lash line, like the outer half. Next up, I'm using a liquid eyeliner on the top to do a wing, and I had to edit most of it out because I was like in the way of the camera, you couldn't see what I was doing. Anyway, then I'm taking a black eyeshadow again and blending out from like halfway along my eye up to that wing, and this is not like super necessary. We're putting glitter on top, but it's just going to give the glitter more dimension when you like turn around in the light. So I'm mixing two glitters together to make a light silver color, and this is what it looks like, and I'm using that lit glitter adhesive to put it on, and I'm just drawing a thin line on that inner part all the way to the outer part and I'm kind of overlapping that smoky black eyeshadow and you'll see what I mean hopefully it kind of gives a little bit more dimension to the glitter Next up I'm using this random chunky glitter. I can't remember what brand this is but I know Lit does a similar one. It's just like a really chunky glitter. Just make sure it's eye safe of course. And then I'm just sticking that on the outer kind of half where my wing is. And I'm kind of overlapping the eyeliner a little bit so it's looking nice and smoky and just a little bit messy but still really cool. I don't know how to describe it really. You just have to kind of look at what I'm doing I guess. And then I'm going to take some false eyelashes. I'm using top and bottom eyelashes today just to balance out that dramatic eyeliner and I also decided to take a slightly darker brown and just pop a little bit of that in the middle of my crease as well just to create a little bit more balance and dimension to my eyes make my eyes look a little bit more deep set and yeah then going on to those bottom lashes and then of course I'm just following up with a bunch of mascara to make sure my natural eyelashes are all nice and black and blended in well with those false lashes I did add powder and concealer and stuff, but I think I wasn't filming. I don't know what happened. But anyway, moving on, I am contouring a little bit more with a powder. Even though I did do that cream, I'm just making it a little bit more dramatic because I wanted it more dramatic. <laughs> it's up to you. And then I'm taking a illuminating bronzer. This one is by Tom Ford, and I'm using that on my cheeks just to create a glowy kind of bronzed face look. I'm also putting on my forehead and nose. And then I'm using the highlighter from this palette, but it wasn't bright enough for me, so I'm using some Charlotte Tilbury on 
on top just mixing and matching and then for my blush today I'm using one by Too Faced it is called Baby Love and it's a really nice kind of like neutral pink color just it goes perfectly with this look because it's not too overpowering and then on my lips I went hot pink today and I love this look color Oh, I'm posing. Okay, there we go. It's called Wifey by Colourpop. So I'm using the colour pencil and then the lippy stick on top of that. And then that is literally it. That's the completed look. I am in love with this lip colour. I think it's so pretty. You could do absolutely any lip colour under the sun with this look though. It's so beautiful. I love it. I hope you love it as well. And if you do recreate it, feel free to send me photos. I would love to see. And if you don't have that chunky glitter, you could always use some little rhinestones from the craft store or like pearls or something. That would look so cute as well. Also, you could feel free to play with a bit of colour. You could do a coloured lower lash line or something if you wanted to make it a little bit more out there and fun. It's totally up to you. There's so many different ways you could take this look. So yeah. If you were inspired or if you enjoyed this look, please give this video a thumbs up and I will talk to you guys really, really soon. Love you guys heaps. Bye. Hey everyone, so today I am doing a swatch video on a bunch of these Viva La Diva Chi Chi lipsticks. I asked you guys in my recent massive, massive unboxing Chi Chi haul if you wanted to see this video and loads of you said yes please, so that's what I'm doing today. These were the two